Hey, hey, Kenny, we're here on Liberty and 6th Street where this demonstration is going to be held not too long from now. They actually had to change the location because of so much interest in the event. It's set to start at 5 o'clock, but we've already seen folks starting to mull around downtown with signs. But we caught up with the organizers today. They say their focus is on education and peace. Calvin Pena is just one of the forces behind a protest for racial injustice planned in Winston-Salem. And we expect to be an example of a community that doesn't have to tear anything down before we build it up. With the focus on organization, peace and education, Pena and others behind the Tuesday event say it is time to begin dismantling systematic racism. When something like that video of George Floyd, when something like that report about Breonna Taylor, when something, I mean, the list goes on and on and on, you either choose to ignore it or feel how it really makes you feel. And those feelings aren't, they're not calm, cool, collected feelings. Event organizers have partnered with downtown businesses in an effort to show mutual support. They say it's imperative the event remain peaceful and be the beginning of a campaign for change. We're going to pass around clipboards for people to put down their information. We're going to keep them updated on the conversations that we're having with our local officials. The rally is slated to begin at 5 o'clock. I mean, I hope that they're inspired by how well organized this is. I hope that they can see the longevity in this, this movement. Um, so that's the main goal, really, is just to let people know that we're not just a bunch of kids, we're not just a bunch of whatever category you put people in that you disagree with in this context, that's not us. We're going to out-organize you. We're going to out-peace you. We're going to out-love you. All right, so as you can see, there's already a uh, group that has formed. They have signs that say Black Lives Matter, George Floyd on those signs. And across the street, that's one of the business businesses that this group has partnered with for this um, event. They say that they want to give people the chance to have places to congregate. Again, the event formally gets going at 5 o'clock. The hope is that folks who come out will have action items that they can take away from tonight's demonstration. In Winston-Salem, Leanne Denyer, WXII 12 News. Leanne, thank you very much, and we'll get to Justin Trayer in Greensboro in a minute, but we want to show you a powerful picture out of the city of Winston-Salem, an officer hugging a protester. This was outside a barber shop on Trade Street. Larry Barron is the man seen with his arms around that police officer. Larry's actually the one who organized today's protest. Tara Tucker took this picture. She writes on Facebook, proud of my city, proud of our leaders, proud of the love I got to capture in this photo. It's a real friendship.